Hi, I'm Mariano with Guitar Center. Today we're taking a look at the Drum Workshop MDD Machine Direct Drive Pedals. This new MDD series is crafted from machined aluminum, which makes these pedals extremely light, yet very durable. Some of you may not be familiar with what direct drive actually means. What we're talking about when we say direct drive is that the linkage between the beater and the footboard is actually solid. Maybe you saw some chain drive pedals or strap driven pedals. Those actually have a lot of flexibility. These are pretty solid. Wherever the footboard goes, the beater goes. So it makes it very accurate, very precise. There's a wide variety of adjustments and tweaks you can make to this pedal to really customize the feel and get it just right. First, you can actually adjust the tension of the springs by using a drum key. Insert the drum key right here. Depending on which way you turn, you can tighten or loosen the springs. You can actually see right here, there's a gauge. If it goes up, it's gonna be looser. If you go the other way, it gives you a little more tension, so the pedal will be a little bit tighter. Another cool adjustment is the footboard height, which can actually be adjusted independently from the beater. With a lot of other pedals, you can kind of do both, but they kind of move at the same time. With this one, you can do one independently from the other. So in this case, if you just open right here, you can see you can adjust the footboard up and down, get it just like you like it. Another great adjustment that you can do with these pedals is the pivot point adjustment. Basically what that does is you open right here and you can move the linkage or the direct drive section up for more direct drive feel or all the way back, which kind of emulates what a chain drive pedal feels like. Another adjustment that you can make to this pedal is the angle of the beater. The great thing, it is independent from the height of the foot plate. Just insert right here with the drum key And there's the angle of the beater moving back and forth. The pivoting toe clamp, it's a great feature on this pedal, actually stays in the open position all the time unless you lock it in place. That makes it real easy for you to take the pedal in and out of your bass drum without scratching it. It's also all rubber coated, which also prevents it from getting any scratches on your bass drum hoop. Because it pivots, there's a little grommets right here, you can actually place your bass drum pedal off to the right or to the left a little bit. Sometimes you don't want to just hit right in the middle. And it'll help the bass drum pedal actually sit flat on the ground. It will just adjust to the curvature of your beater. This is great also for double pedals, which sometimes you want to have the two beaters kind of off center or center on the bass drum, so you can actually do that. Both MDD pedals feature a floating cam. You may be familiar with the floating cam from the 9000 series of pedals. When I say floating cam, what that means is the cam is actually not attached to the shaft of the pedal like on traditional pedals. So when you isolate this part and you press on the pedal, you can see that it moves independently, giving you a very fluid, kind of lightweight motion. There are three different beater surfaces, felt, rounded felt, and rubber. To exchange them, super easy, just unscrew it right here, just the front part of it, remove it, and then you can install the different ones, the rounded one or the rubber one. Once you remove the beater head, you actually will have access to four different slots where you can insert weights. This is another way to customize the beater feel of this drum pedal. The great thing about this bass drum beater is that it's self-adjusting. So it doesn't matter what angle the bass drum is, every time you play it, the head will adjust itself and you'll get an even contact with the bass drum head. All those adjustments we just went over do apply to the double bass pedal as well. There are a couple of things that are worth mentioning. On the left side, you'll notice that it is a single post casting that allows you to place your hi-hat really close for smooth movement between the hi-hat and your left foot. It also features a ball bearing universal joint that is unique to this pedal. What that does, it gives you zero lag and zero play for a very uniform feel between the left and the right foot. You can't tell the difference between the left and the right. Included with both these pedals is a black DW carry bag. DW MDD, Machine Direct Drive Pedals. Check them out at Guitar Center stores or guitarcenter.com.